to help Nigerians in rural areas meet up with the deadline to return old Naira notes to commercial banks by January 31st, the Central Bank of Nigeria has deployed a team from Abuja to remote areas in the northeast. The CBN team was in the northern part of Gombe State for the currency swap program. Ibrahim Ismail reports. The CBN team visited to Kumaket, the Kuloku government area of Gombe State, northeast Nigeria, to make the newly redesigned Nera notes available to residents of the area. There was, prior to this visit, a scarcity of the newly redesigned Nera notes in the area. Not surprisingly, some Nigerians who swapped their old notes with the newly redesigned notes are delighted with the development. <laughs> I swapped 10,000 Nera notes. I would endeavor to swap the remaining old notes in my possession by tomorrow or so. I urge others to do the same for the deadline. People are now swapping the old notes. Before this time, there is scarcity. Businesses have stand still. But now, we have the redesigned notes we thank God. The CBN team deployed to Gobe State, which operates under the leadership of Director of Development Finance Yusuf Philip Gila, also paid a courtesy visit to the palace of the Emir of Duku, Arun Abdulkadir Rashid. The traditional ruler asked the Apex Bank to extend the 31st January deadline to help Nigerians seamlessly swap their old notes. Uh, whatever comes new is always difficult for people to, 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 to invite, difficult for people to, to buy it. But people have started realizing their mistake. And that's why they are coming out almost to see that they change their currency. So there's a need, if possible, for the bank to give another grace period so that people can actually you can mop up whatever is left of the old currency. Many see the deployment of special team of the CBN rural areas as a laudable tactical maneuver. But with the Apex Bank's deadline just about a week away, there are those that believe that the move has been left too late in the day. From Gombe, Ibrahim Ismail reporting for Trust TV.